Hello everyone and welcome to part number 8 of this journeyman save here with Huddersfield Town, our third club in this journeyman save. And yeah, god this is going to come down to the wire but there is very very much a chance boys and girls we could be heading for the Premier League. But without further ado, if you are enjoying the series and haven't already, do make sure you are leaving a big old like on the episodes and leaving any comments down below and also if you're new around here do make sure you hit that big old subscribe button and the bell next to it for notifications but without further ado let us not waste any more time let's get straight into this episode All right, and here we are. This is the results that have gone on since that last episode yesterday. We have a 1-0 loss to Barnsley, where we played okay, not brilliantly, but, yeah, it's a game we should have won, really, at home. Team that are in the, like, the lower depths of the league. Then we had Oxford, 2-0 win, Beckham Wiley and Liam Walsh. Then we had Nottingham Forest, a 1-1 draw, Sarmiento for us. After Bradley Dak had given them the lead. And we hammered Cardiff 4-0. Sobby Thomas, Sarmiento, a Proctor own goal, and then Akinwale. And we had, then we drew against Bristol City 1-1. Liam Walsh getting our goal. After they'd taken the lead from Fiorin, Fiorentino early on. And then most recently, Luton beat nicely 3-0. Hodgkinson. PK getting his first goal for the club, and Liam Walsh. Obviously, PK only being five foot seven, I think he is. Uh, yeah, five foot seven, scored with a header. As you can see, his jumping reach isn't great, but he does have pretty good header at this level. Yeah, finally got his first goal for us. So for today, obviously we've got Bill Wall, and then we have QPR. But Let's not waste any time. Let's just go meet the team that is going out there today to take on QPR. We are going with this team. Very different team. We are going with Cody Drummer on the left because... Um, where is he? Elder isn't fully fit. Um, Naby Sartre and Welch in mid um, central defence. Edmunds Green... Is on the right because we've sent Hodgkinson on a week's holiday um, just because he was uh, feeling jaded. Clarkson at the base of midfield, Walsh and Ball ahead of him, PK in on the left, Sorba Thomas on the right, Akinwale again up top. But yeah, Akinwale sort of stalled a little bit, but he is still our top goal scorer. Troy Parrott got injured, so he's going to miss probably the rest of the season, fortunately. So... Let us head on in and see how we do. The interesting thing for this is going to be how Cody Drama does on that left wing, left fullback position. So it's not a position I um, used to him being in. Um, we've been on a good run lately. We'll continue with that one. Yeah. Yeah, not used to him playing on the left. So it'll be interesting to see how he holds up. So. If things aren't are disastrous, we can always move Sar out there and um, put Edmonds Green into central defence and move Drama over to the right. And yeah, obviously Norwich have since the last episode cl clinched the playoffs. So, yeah, this is a game, again, we should be winning. See if we can. We are at home. Setford to Welch. And Setford, if he, score, if he keeps one more clean sheet... We'll have a new record for the league for clean sheets. He's already tied it at 18. Edmunds Green, superb ball over for Akinwale, who puts us 1-0 up. Get in. 14th goal of the season. This is the kind of thing you like to see. Yeah, we are pushing for that automatic promotion spot. I think we might... I don't know. I've just got that feeling we're going to have that end of season nerves hit us and then we drop into the playoffs but 
Who knows? We might get lucky. Yeah, he's easily onside. Yeah, I'm liking PK more. The more and more I see of him as well. No, he wasn't involved there. His Clarkson over for Naby Sar. It's the woodwork. What? Oh my god! Clarkson now picking it up. Pulls it inside to ball. All right, it's still continuing here as well. And then it stops. Just as I say that. Just offer some encouragement because we are playing well. And I hate it when you do encouragement when you 1-0 up. So many of them get complacent. It's annoying. All right. Thank you for them now, Savile. Back to Williams for them. Here's Shirak. Romeo. PK nicks it though. Gives it to Cody Drama. Back to PK. Clarkson. Walsh over the top, looking for Akamwali, but it's cut out. Now Savile, Tetek, could they hit us on? Hit us now. Savile again, out to Bennett, over the top. Tetek, what a run! Good little chip over Setford there. That was a good little bit of play. Going to demand more, and we're actually going to go positive because we are the home team. But this was a well-worked goal in the end by the Bennett. Superb ball. Tetek with a beautiful run. Dink over Setford. Perfect. So Setford isn't going to set that clean sheets record today. But as it stands, we are still two points clear of West Brom. Massive goal difference. 13 We've got a plus 13 goal difference on them. So, far from pleased, we should be winning. So, yeah, instantly, it's Edmunds Green, ball, Edmunds Green. Clarkson, Edmunds Green again, ball. Thomas, a cracking effort. Lots of bend on it. Uh, all right. While he's taking an ox, Patterson's going to go up top. All right. What can we do here? Might even totally f mess things up. Go with the um, 442 diamond arrow. All right, it's Cody Drama now with the throw in on the left hand side. Here's Walsh. Clarkson. Back to Nabi Sar. To Ball. Clarkson again. Ball again. Thomas. Edmunds Green with space. Was it inside to Thomas? Oh, it's cut out. I think PK was the one in there looking to get on the end of it. Clarkson all the way back to Setford. Gives it to Nabi Sar. We do. It's with Walsh. Now PK again. But we might move PK up top. Alongside Patterson. Good ball over, but there's... Oh, Duffy's in here. No one went out to cover it. Whipped in, and that's a penalty. No. All right, we're going to see what happens with this penalty. Come on. Disappointing that we've given away a penalty. Huddersfield. Come on, Savile. Miss. What a save by Setford. And Drama. First to the rebound. That's what we like to see, right? Tactics. Yeah, we're going to go to the, to this. So, PK can play as that, play as that, and then you can be a target forward, support. And we're going to bring on, so, he's going to bring on in that Sober Thomas role. But Sober Thomas is actually able to play there. Sarmiento, no. It's annoying. Um, yes, yeah, so we're going to go to that. We're going to bring on... Oh. Sorry, we're going to bring Sar on. We're going to drop him to a attacking midfielder. On no, keep him on attack. Um, and then, finally... Nowhere for you to play. Annoyingly, Sarmiento, 
So yeah, we're going to save that last sub then. We might use it, we might not. Demand more. Let's see if we can manage to pull something off with this. But uh, it's Bill Wool with the attack here, Tetek. And they got the goal. Then Setford had that covered if it was on target. But it was wide and high. Uh, it's Banku now with the throw in for them. Short throw into Iqbal. Oh, Tetek is through again here. Setford sticks a foot out. <laughs> so it just knocked it wide. It is a corner for Millwall. Duffy now with the corner. In swing, I look. Walsh at the far post. Walsh or Welch? I don't quite see. I think it was Walsh. He's Archer now. O'Shea. Nothing comes of that. All right. Do that final change. Okay. All right, then, for the last couple of minutes. Come on. Yeah, nothing came of it, unfortunately. Not good enough, that's the sort of game we should be winning, and it is, but I mean, we are still two points clear in that second place, so let us move on to the next game against QPR in 13 days. So I shall see you for that match. See you in a minute, folks. All right, folks, here we are back for that second game of the episode against QPR. And it's a very familiar looking side going out there today. We're going with. Oh, we're going to turn around. Going with Setford in goal, Elder, Abisar, Welch, and Hodgkinson in defence. Clarkson basically made a Walsh and ball ahead of him. Sarmiento on the left, Thomas on the right, and Akin Wale up the top. Uh, without further ado, let us head on out there. Yeah, the reason I made that last minute change with Sarmiento is because. Obviously. PK doesn't speak the language yet, so you know, just give him a bit more time to settle. Um, we know how good Sarmiento's been this season for us. So hopefully we can pick up the win in this second match. Uh, here we go, here's Hodgkinson. Welch, I'm back to Hodgkinson. Nearly overrun it there. Clarkson, Welch again. Now we saw Clarkson. Now, all the way back to Setford, who hoofs it upfield. And Akinwale is nowhere near it. Now QPR coming on the attack, but Clarkson cuts that out superbly. Here is Akinwale. Spots Thomas on the run. Out wide. On the right. Gets the cross in. And there's Sami Endo. Justifying why we made that last second change. Oh, what a, what a kid this is. And he is going to be a superstar for us. I know he is. Uh, this was superbly played. Thomas making the perfect run. As you can see, Sarmiento running in perfectly there. More, more maybe could have blocked that, but... Yeah, he didn't, didn't even make an attempt for it, as it stands. But if things stay as they are, we will be four points clear. Shula for them. Now Sibley. So... Cross turner is headed over from March. All right. Drop a bit of praise because we've played well so far. In these games. Well, I'll say that. We've only had two, three shots now. But a bit of praise. We'll do them good. All right. Come on, boys. And hold until half time. I'll be happy. Yeah. Love a second goal. Um, we've not played our best. It's Bentley now for them. Hoofed upfield. Gabby Saar wins the header. Sorba Thomas plays it down to Hodgkins and he plays it all the way back to Setford. Hoofed over the top. Here's Akinwale. Pure route one there. Akinwale missed. What? Banked on him scoring that goal. That is insane. I don't like what I just saw. Even though we are 1 0 up, we have not been at our best at all. Come on, boys. Walsh now. It's in the free kick, but they had it clear, and now Sibley can break. We do have three men back. Clarkson with the tackle. Clarkson straight red. Wow. 
That is not what we needed. So what we do is we It's gonna be the better deep line playmaker. There we go then, and he stays the ball winner actually. Yeah, we're just gonna go like that. Let's confirm that change and pray that we can hold on. Uh, it's, it's male class asked for them field now. The tackle by Elder. Now uh, it's back with Elder Walsh again. Nabi Sar. Welch, Nabi Sar. Youth Silfield. Akamali gets there first there. Sarmiento. Walsh. Nabi Sar. Walsh again. Loses out to Sibley though. It's in with Dykes. And Dykes equalises. London Dykes gets the equaliser. And now it's just going to be a case of, can we hold on? Uh, I mean, that was poor by Walsh here, really. Uh, yeah. We did, we did well. We nearly managed to get the ball off Dykes there with Welch. Uh, just got the right side of the of Welch. And now it's the frame. We've saw me enter now. Walsh. Ball. Whipped in Akamwale with the header just over the bar. Yeah, we are. We have to make sure we keep this keep this tight. All right. Maturin. What a strike by Maturin. Maturin. Sounds better. Um, don't know if I'm pronouncing it right, but... Shula. This finish though, what a finish. Setford stood no chance whatsoever there. Alright, we are I'm gonna go positive. Then we should probably go defensive. I'm gonna make a couple of changes now. We are going to I'm gonna bring PK on for Akamwali. Drop him back. There. I'm going to do this. Massive, massive reshot. Two inside forwards. I'm going to be on attack. You're going to play a support role. There's a shadow striker, actually. We'll play all three of them on attack. And we are going to proper go for it right here. Drop you back to a support role. All right, see what we can do here. Not huge changes, but it is what it is, Shula. Setford gathers that easily. And can we manage to build a break? All right, Setford. Rolls it out to Nabisar. Back to Setford again, now Welch. Played up to Sarmiento. Now Thomas loses out there with John. Field. Over the top, and Maturin's through. That's it, just wide. Thank God. This will drop us to third place, though. Alright, we're going to do that one. Bring Jogadzi on. Alright, what do we do? Do that final change as well. Alright, can we somehow get the ball here and nick it? Bentley, taking his time, hoofed upfield. Welch won it, but Maturin wins it rather than Hodgkinson. Poor effort there, and now Setford. Now it's final throw in for it. Thomas into PK. Thomas, out for another throw in. They brought on Maurizio Pochettino, son of the manager Maurizio Pochettino, not a Welsh. It's another throw in. We are putting the pressure on in these final few seconds. Elder, Thomas, Walsh. Back to ball. The way back to Edmunds Green, which is not what we wanted. And we have been defeated, but we were down to 10 men. Do not like what I just saw at all. Clarkson getting sent off was huge for us. Shouldn't 
Uh, yeah. That, that. Um, Thomas Separate Clarkson. Don't appeal. As is. Thomas is on course for an assist bonus. Yeah, obviously, the next episode shall be the final two games of the season, Coventry and Hull. So, without further ado, shall we end things here, folks. Again, if you're enjoying the series, do make sure you leave a big old thumbs up on it. And also, if you are new around here, do make sure that you hit that big old subscribe button and the bell next to it for notifications for when videos go live. But without further ado, I'll see you all on the flip side. Bye-bye. Thank <laughs> you.